How to paint over semi-gloss. If you have semi-gloss, you know that it's a very shiny surface somewhere in your house. I don't really have any in this house, but let's pretend this trim is semi-gloss. It's very shiny. First thing I want to do is determine whether it's an oil-based product on there or a water base. I will take my sanding paper. My prediction is since it's built in the 70s, it's an oil base. And also that I've done a lot of work in this house and it's always oil base. What happens with the oil base is when you sand it, dust falls off onto your hand and onto the floor. If this was a water-based product, you would end up with some latex goop on your sandpaper and it wouldn't sand the same way. It would leave marks, not smooth it out. That's the first thing to determine. Then, you would, it, in order to paint over it, you are going to prime it, lightly sand it and prime it or use something called a deglosser that you can buy in your hardware store and just follow the directions on the back of the, of the jar to uh, minimize the glossiness of the surface. What you want to do is make sure that whatever you're going to put on there sticks because it is slick. So prep, preparation, degloss, sand, and prime is always usually the best thing to do. Uh, using a water-based primer if you want to go back to water-based and put it on the whole semi-gloss surface and then go on and do whatever it is you want to do.